I think there's probably three really important um, changes and shifts in the new TEKS that people should pay close attention to. One would be the three-dimensional learning in science, the opportunities these new standards provide for that to happen. Another is that specific integration of engineering practices that was not there before. And then the third one is that there are changes in some of the content standards that in some case actually increase that in intentional progression of knowledge from grade to grade that weren't there before. So the science practices and recurring themes and um, concepts is those additions are really important. The content ones are also important. And then um, integration of those engineering practices. Can we go back to the three-dimensional learning in science for just a minute? Yeah, I think that's really the most important one in my mind because the changes in the science practices, we had them before, but these are much more explicit and much more encompassing of lots of different kinds of practices um, that scientists are involved in on a daily basis. And then the addition of those recurring things and concepts that weren't there before. When you take those three things, we're moving from a two-dimensional way of looking at our standards to a three-dimensional way that truly allows us to integrate those three different types of standards into three-dimensional learning.